Let's learn about earthquakes and tsunamis. If you feel the earth moving under your feet, it could be because a Mack truck is barreling by, or maybe you're at a ripping concert, or maybe it's because you're experiencing an earthquake. Call it whatever you like, a quake, or a tembler, or a tremor. It can be unpredictable, and it can be very scary when the earth begins to shake. When a vibration travels through the earth's crust, this is an earthquake. They happen somewhere on the earth every day. Here is what may be happening as geoscientists seek to explain what causes earthquakes. The outer layer of the earth is called the crust. The crust sits on many different layers that rests upon ginormous plates which cover the earth. Beneath these tectonic plates, deep down in the bowels of the earth, are areas of molten rock and metals. The tectonic plates drift and move, and not much, but it's enough to cause the Earth's crust to fracture and create faults and folds. The faults in the Earth create humongous pressures, and the crust begins to slip and heave and throw, and the next thing you know, it's an earthquake. Geologists study these fault zones. They measure their movement. They take thousands of pictures. They watch and wait and wait and wait. They hope to someday be able to predict where an earthquake will occur and when. Earthquakes can cover vast distances. They may be so slight you may never feel it. You might see your hanging ceiling light swing. Or an earthquake may be so massive and violent to cause widespread destruction, flooding and fires. Volcanoes may erupt following a series of earthquakes. In 1989, the monstrous earthquake of the Bay Area in California rocked the major cities of San Francisco and Oakland. The Tembler caused landslides, fires, buildings crumbled and cracked, homes demolished. A double-decker freeway collapsed and flattened cars below. The damage came to a cost of billions of dollars to repair. The epicenter the point on the earth where the greatest force originates was 60 miles away. And yet, these two major cities were struck with enormous force and destruction. There were fewer cars than usual during rush hour on the roads and expressways. You see, on that day, October 17, 1989, Game 3 of the World Series was being played in San Francisco's Candlestick Park. The Oakland A's and the San Francisco Giants and their fans were in the stadium when the earth shook. Amazing! Even more shocking, San Francisco was also the site of the devastating quake of 1903. At that time, the entire city was mostly destroyed. Throughout history, millions of people have been affected by the wrath of the invisible destroyer. You don't see it coming, and you may not know when it will strike. The day after Christmas of 2004, many miles below the seabed of the Indian Ocean, the movement of two tectonic plates caused a series of enormous waves of water over a hundred feet high to strike 14 countries bordering the Indian Ocean. Indonesia was the hardest hit, then Sri Lanka, India, and then Thailand. Hundreds of thousands of people were affected. These huge waves caused by earthquakes are named tsunamis. Any coastal town is at risk of being struck by a tsunami. They can begin from hundreds of miles out to sea and travel at a speed of over 500 miles an hour. As fast as a jet, you cannot outrun, outdrive a tsunami. The wall of water may travel for miles and miles inland, and the best thing to do is head for higher ground. If you should be caught in an earthquake, there are some things you can do. If you are indoors, stay indoors. Drop down and take cover under a desk or a table. Stay indoors until the shaking stops. And stay away from anything that can fall on you. And stay away from windows. If you are outdoors, find a clear spot away from buildings and trees and power lines. Living on this magnificent planet is marvelous. So much to learn so much to see, so much to experience. Perhaps you may want to become a geoscientist and study the Earth. You just may be the person to discover a way to predict where and when the next earthquake will strike. Hope you had fun learning with us. Visit us at learnbright.org.
for thousands of free resources and turnkey solutions for teachers and homeschoolers.